Howdy, everybody. Howdy. <laughs> they don't say that here. It's the best time, so I can't really complain. Um, I'm lucky to be doing best times right now, two for two right now. So um, it's good. It's I'm not really satisfied, but I think that's what keeps me going and keeps me motivated. So. Uh, it's good to take a step back and look at what I did wrong and how much I know I can improve for the years to come. So in the end, it's okay, but it's just a step in the right direction. I talked a lot about where I am at mentally and I think uh, all the years I've kind of been like, it'll be fun when I swim fast, but I think I need to be more in the mentality to have fun to swim fast. And I think I've been shifting in the right direction, definitely working through anxiety and everything with swimming and trying to step towards that so it's a work in progress and the fact that I'm able to recognize that and kind of step forward with my coaches and my support staff um, it's easy to say oh I need to fix this turn oh I need to fix these underwaters but I think um, until I'm mentally there it's harder to do that so um, I think there's a lot of technical issues there's always going to be technical flaws in every single race even if it's a best time so uh, taking those little technical things and working to just be a little bit more excited about swimming. Um, I think I definitely this type of mentality with the team behind you. It's really easy to get excited, and I'm glad I have the support of them. But just working on myself and working through the little things and just keep getting better. It's always been a team goal of ours to just try and get better and better each year. And so right now, uh, where we are in the points is where we are. It's uh, just reflection of the swims that we've had. And so I think we always get better as the meet goes on. So I'm pretty excited for the events to come and how many points we'll score in the two breast. It's always a good one. <laughs> for our breaststroke, just the way that we train, it's such a good environment to be around. Everyone is just so supportive of everyone. And I think that's very rare in a team. I think there's always going to be that kind of like, oh, I really want to beat her. But for us, really it is. I want you to do better and I want myself to do better and if you do good then I'm going to do good and it's just positive and positive and so um, I think that environment is just the best thing in the world to train in and so I, when we get to these meets and we finally get to kind of put the numbers on the board is the most exciting part so I'm ready for tomorrow. It's hard right now. I don't think we realize that this is kind of going to be the last time we both wear the A&M next to each other at an NCAA so um, it's a little bittersweet. I am going to miss her next year racing her in NCAA. I'm going to have her at practice kicking my butt all the time so that's not going to go anyway any let go away anytime soon but um i think it, it's pretty special i mean today we weren't next to each other on the podium and it hurt a little bit it hurt a little bit but um i think it, everything between us is so genuine like we really just want the best for each other and i remember talking to her yesterday and i was like oh have you you've been a 53 before and then two i'm just like no i haven't and i was like well you're gonna do that tonight and then she went 53 one and i was like i told you and so it's just moments like that that we're always gonna have and luckily she's gonna be my training buddy for a little bit longer Oh, she was wearing a suit. <laughs>